sorry for the weird angle, but you know, pop socket life. This is what I'm working with right now. This is what I've got. And there's a lot of construction going on. So lots of beeps, lots of bangs, lots of cars. So honestly, today I just was kind of over it. I didn't really feel like climbing too much just because I was kind of tired. So I decided to kind of split my time in half of really working on this like one, it's like kind, it's technically I think like a yoga pose, but I don't know what it's called. I just, I know it as a back bend and I really am trying to work on the flexibility in my shoulders and that is a really good thing to do to work on that. So really just like as of the last couple of days, I've been trying to focus on, on, a, on doing back bends. And like I can do a back bend fairly easily. Like my, my back doesn't hurt. It's always been um, pretty flexible. But getting my arms like straight and yeah, just shoulder flexibility, yo. It's a thing. And it's a thing that I don't really have enough of anyways. So there's that. I mean, plus honestly, like just as like a personal thing, like I just really, I like that pose and I would like to be able to do it like better and to the best of my ability. So what I've really been trying to do is, like I said, I can do it easily just like from the ground up. Um, but one thing that I really wanna be able to do is kind of just from a standing position, go back into it. So a lot of what I'll do is practice by using a wall and walking my hands down. So that way I can get used to that. And then just practicing what I can do from a standing position to, to get into bridge pose, I think is what it's called. That just hit me. And then I've also just been kind of working on like staying in the actual back bend and kind of like just going back and forth to really try and get my shoulders flexible and opened up and then switching legs by going in the air because like obviously the goal would be to get them straight right now they're kind of like Meh. so yeah that general kind of thing again like I said I've just been trying to do that not for any actual reason other than like I just really want to get that down so I spent a good like 40 minutes doing that today and then the other half of my time at the gym was spent doing um, not climbing I guess like actual problems but doing what's called circuits which in that case what you do is instead got the wall and then there's pieces of tape that are colored and you just go with that specific color. I'm really bad at explaining that, but yeah. So basically I was doing the green one. So all I did was have to look for the next green piece of tape and on some of them, and they'll tell you like number one, number two, number three, number four, number five. So you kind of have to look. So there were some times where I'd be like on the wall, I'd be like at number like seven and eight and I'd be like, where is nine? And I'm like looking all over for this green piece of tape that says number nine. So that's kind of what I did today. And I just did that over and over and over again until I just like, my arms just couldn't hang in there anymore. No, no pun intended. So like on the first couple of tries, I got up to like number 15 and I couldn't for the life of me find 16 or 17 or whatever where it kept going. So I just did it to 15 and then stopped. And so I did it again to 15 and then stopped. And then of course, by the time I'm like tired, I was like, oh, there's 16 and 17 and 20 and whatever. So by that point I was like, man, I'm really tired, but I'm gonna do it because I know that I should have I should have been able to see this. So I kind of just like pushed through and did that anyways. And it was not very pretty, but I did it. And then after that, since I was so tired, I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna use the rest of my time to kind of just like mess around and and just grab any holds that I want. So like I kind of just like made my own little problem. It was fun. It was what I wanted to do because I have a really big commitment issue with big moves. Um, so that's really what I was working on with that first move because it was low to the ground. So I really just wanted to like get that in, in the habit of doing that. And um, then the rest were kind of like these really crimpy holds, which crimps are my fave. So I was down with that. And then that was pretty much it. So that was all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it and
I'll see you next time.